Hi, I'm Tim Frost, and when I started adding more and more videos to my YouTube channel, I was finding that the new ones were placed at the wrong end of the playlist, and I just couldn't see them. I knew you could change the way YouTube ordered the videos, and also that you could change the order manually, but I just couldn't find out where and how. That's because these tools are a bit tucked away. So here's a short tutorial on how to do it, which I wish I'd had then. Start in Creator Studio and select the playlist in the Video Manager. Now click on the playlist you want to reorder. Now you might think you can start doing things here, but no, you have to go down a further level. So click on Edit again. Now you're in the real playlist editing space. Here you can see how it is currently being sorted. Clicking on Ordering, you can choose what order setting YouTube will default to. Date added, latest or oldest first, and the same for date published. That's important if you use the time a lot. And most popular if you want the biggies at the front. You should click here to automatically put your latest video at the front when you load it. This is a default setting really for most of us. I'm going to Manual for reordering. Before I start, I take a quick click on Most Popular, as that's an easy way of looking at what's top on your channel, as you may want to keep one or two of those in your top five. Now click back on Manual to manually move them around. Now the traditional YouTube advice for manual reordering is to use a mouse to drag and drop the video up and down the order. Here we go. Click to the left of the position number and you'll see the grab handle. Grab it and pull it down. Easy. Only one problem. It all stops when you get to the bottom of the screen, so you have to drop it there, scroll down and drag drop again. The better way is to click on the grab handle and use the keyboard up and down keys to move the video around. Or you can hold the mouse key down with one finger and use the scroll wheel to do the same thing. As well as being able to move up and down the whole list, it's actually easier to control what you're doing this way. Just before I go, I might as well go over these other two playlist settings. This allows others to embed your series in website pages. Since more places it's seen, the more views you get. So always click on this, unless you want to make your playlist only available on your channel. For example, it's a set of family videos. And if your site is verified, you can set the playlist as an official series. If your list has a distinct theme, then making it a series tells YouTube that everyone watching one of these videos will probably be interested in others in the list, and that can't be a bad thing. So if you found this useful, give it a like, and of course, subscribe for more YouTube and video making tutorials and reviews.